people must be prepared to accept when rulings adverse to their interests are given by the court and not go on a rampage attacking the court or releasing press statements to criticize those decisions. And when I reflect on cases whose outcomes I personally consider undesirable, regardless of my own views on the persons being judged in them, I can only come to a conclusion that what we have in this country is a fiercely independent judiciary in which all of us should take pride in. That an aggrieved citizen can go to a court of law and challenge anyone, including decisions of the president and parliament, and be confident that the court will give a decision without fear or favor. My lady, I will only urge the judiciary to ensure that their processes are devoid of undue delays and other inefficiencies. For a robust legal system, an appeal by rule of law goes hand in hand with economic prosperity and bolsters the confidence of the people and deters the perpetration of wrongdoing. A court system in which summary trial of criminal cases can last for more than five years militates against the right to a fair trial, defeats the end of justice, and must be looked at again. It is unjust and unfair for so-called high-profile criminal cases involving the sudden offense of fraud, willfully causing financial loss to the state and money laundering, to drag on for years, while similar cases filed against the perceived ordinary members of society are concluded within six months to one year.